Hi there, I'm Jason Schrummel. I work for Special Olympics Maryland, and I'm here with Tammy Holabaugh from uh, Carroll County, uh, who is our Athlete of the Month. We wanted to catch up with her and ask her a few questions today on this fall afternoon. Tammy, welcome. Thank you. So Tammy, how long have you been involved with Special Olympics Maryland? The past 19 years. And uh, can you list the sports that you participate in? I participate in basketball, soccer, fly football, uh, bowling, and I think that's it. It's a lot of sports. Yeah. Uh, how do you? How come you feel uh, that so many sports are important? It helps me, you know, be healthy and you know, keeps me energetic and you know, just have a great time. Great. What are uh, what are some of the your favorite aspects of being on a team or participating in the sports? Um, you know. The best part about you know being on a team is not only you know cheering on for your team, but also cheering on the other teams. That's the best part of being in Special Olympics. Uh, can you tell me one of your favorite memories of being in Special Olympics? Um, probably when I was like, I want to say eight. Um, I was doing track and field for the first time, and um, I can't remember like what um my race was, but uh, I, did, I think I did the 25 meter um, run, and um, we started running, and uh, this boy stopped to look at a butterfly, so me and the other athletes went by, back to him and got his arm, like, you know, his hand, and just, you know, finished the race, and that's the best part of it. Well, great, thanks. Um, how do you think Special Olympics Maryland has uh, improved your health overall? Um, just, you know, Constantly practicing, you know, working out and, you know, just, you know, having the coaches motivate me and, you know, m most importantly, just practicing. That's the best part. Uh, so tell us a little more about yourself. Uh, Where did you go to high school? I went, I, it's actually um, a high school into college. It's called Post Canary. Um, they divide it into like high school into college. So that's where I went to. Okay. Great. Uh, and a little bit more. What do you uh, What do you do during the day as a, as a job or as volunteering? I actually work at the YMCA with the kids, and um, you know I just interact with them, play Play-Doh, and you know make sure that they're you know being safe. Great. Um, you've had the opportunity to travel a little bit with Special Olympics. Can you tell me a bit about that? <laughs> I've um, been invited to. Um, go to nationals last year actually and we actually came home with the gold medal for soccer for Maryland so it was, that was awesome. Great. What are uh, what are some of your hobbies when you're not uh, doing like four or five of your sports? <laughs> um, just you know hang out with my friends, um, listening to music and shopping. <laughs> <laughs> Great. Um, what do you think the future holds for you in the next five years, ten years? Um, you know, continue being an athlete in Special Olympics and hopefully traveling to, uh, you know, tell people about Special Olympics and, you know, try and get, you know, Special Olympics to grow even more. Okay. If there was uh, one or two things that you would want people to know about you that maybe they don't know, well, what would you like to share? Honestly, you know, people may think that, you know, people with disabilities are different and you know can't be active and you know have jobs but I want people to understand that you know people with disabilities can you know be independent and can you know have a job and be healthy. Uh, if there's uh, someone out there who's thinking of becoming a special mix athlete what would be uh, one piece of advice you would have for them? You know keep your head up high, keep practicing and you know be you know strong and keep your dreams up. Great, thank you. So this is uh, Jason Trimble signing off with Tammy Holabaugh. Uh, thank you and have a good day.